one of the nicest thing, uh, things in the world are board games. Okay, I think they're wonderful. Okay, they're lovely. And I think the people who initiate board games are extremely warm and nice people. Because every time when you're together and the person who takes initiative says, Hey, let's play a board game. Everyone's like, hey, do Like no one, no one supports it. And they still have the positivity to continue. Be like, no, no, just give it a shot. And then everyone has fun. And no one remembers the person who initiated. Okay? So I think they should be celebrated. And also I think board games are amazing. Uh, I mean, in the age of technology, who is playing real games, right? So, uh... I had to start in chronological order. Like, what's the first game I ever played? Ludo. 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 No, 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 no. You guys, that requires material. This, I, the first game I ever played was X and O. Okay. Yeah. Uh, the thing about X and O is the best because that's the only game you can play in class because you don't need to talk. X and O is like the most easily consensual game to play. You just do like. And it's suddenly you become expert theater mime artist. <laughs> it's like you do a move and you... <laughs> XNO was my first. And the only problem with XNO is that in five minutes it becomes boring. Okay? <laughs> because it's a very predictable game. My next favorite Bihari game is Name Place Animal Play. It unites us. <laughs> I feel if there's a stampede somewhere, I'll yell, Name Place! Everyone's like, Animal Thing! And everyone just dies. <laughs> Again, anyone who initiates name plays animal thing, hey, who? Who name plays? And in the middle, everyone's like, oh, hey, hey, hey! <laughs> My handwriting hasn't been that bad till I play name plays animal thing. The, the, the struggle of Z and, and X. <laughs> I think there's a certain shame uh, when you don't, you made up something. And you say it with a straight face. <laughs> with the letters Y. And you're like, yeah. Yold fish. <laughs> it's an old goldfish. <laughs> Check! Google it! Google it! Google it! It's there. My favorite. Now, then, as someone said, Ludo, right? I think I, before Ludo, I played... Uh, Sneaks and Ladders. Yeah, it's a great game. Okay, and I don't know if you remember the most, uh, the most important. I think the most memorable one one is this one, the giant, the giant snake. It's amazing how beautifully it's played. It's played at like 94. Right when it teaches you humility, you can't celebrate. The most arrogant tyrants have fallen. At this point, like, I'm gonna win. Oh, oh! And just the energy difference in them from 94 to 90. They're like, you know, I don't even like this game. Uh, just, it goes from this game, I'm the best, to I'm not even playing. I was not even paying attention. Um, so this is awesome because I love this. Because when you're a kid, it's just a giant game. It's a giant snake. But when you grow up, you realize it's it's self doubt. Okay, so that's the metaphor. <laughs> so I didn't know, I just found out that Snakes and Ladders is a very old game. Uh, it's a very yeah. ancient game apparently. Yeah, because what do children love? Snakes! <laughs> and they were like, and what else? Ladders! <laughs> Two of the most favorite things of kids. Snakes and ladders. And I, I love how the concept is so flawed but they're trying really hard. They made all the snakes so cute. <laughs> all of them are insanely cute but they have venom in them like most of the people we meet. Uh, yes. Yeah, it's, it's a life lesson. Wow, you guys are great. Uh, now, obviously, I can't uh, come up, I can't talk about board games unless I talk about the oldest board game there is. Monopoly. 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 <laughs> 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 yeah, chess. I'm talking about chess, guys. I'm talking about chess. Oh, remember during the Romans used to play Monopoly? Ah, oh, man. Those are the times. <laughs> now, chess is awesome. I think now the moment I see a chess board, I'm like, I don't want to be friends with you. Immediately. <laughs> like, hey, gosh, you want to play chess? Like, no. no. Why are you, are you excited? <laughs> there now, are, uh, do all of you know how to play chess? Yeah. Yeah. No? No one taught you how to play chess? No. That's, 
I feel like it was if you're an Indian kid you're forced to know forced how to, to play. Yeah, yes. I feel like if you go to American immigration to check. <laughs> I mean, are you really Indian? Can you play Shatranj? Okay. <laughs> Yeah guys that's a legit name it's a scientific name uh you know if every time i play chess because the game is so boring the only argument is what do you call the pieces okay everyone has different names some people have like prof like proper names like minister some people have names like gugu i don't know uh, yeah this is makeup shit <laughs> and every time so what is this piece bishop bishop oh sorry. Sorry. sorry yeah that that is a piece Oh, Bishop of the Camel, right? Yeah. Two completely different things. <laughs> I've never been, never gone to a desert and be like, "Hey, Bishop!" <laughs> oh no, it's a camel. It's never happened. I've never seen a palace with a camel just sitting in the courtyard. Like, <laughs> Now the, what is this one? Pawan. I mean, Did you say Pawan? <laughs> is that? Oh, right. Or a soldier, right? Soldier. 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 I always visualize this guy as like, <laughs> like I always did. This guy was like, he's gonna go out immediately. Every time I took him out, he's like, no, no, I hate this game. I always die. <laughs> the queen was the most badass. The queen, because she, badass, yeah. yeah, queen is easiest uh, to remember. Because she can go everywhere. Because yeah. she Beyonce. <laughs> this is a queen. So this is a queen. Yeah. So this is a queen, and this is a king. Okay. The king is a dumbass. Yeah. So Such a dumbass. She has to keep protecting him and run the kingdom with him and do something for him. <laughs> slow as hell. Like, uh, like, uh, yeah. I'm talking about chess, guys. <laughs> Just. So as mm. <laughs> Now for me the my the the <laughs> this is my favorite piece because it's the most beautiful. Yeah. What is this? Oh, yeah, there's never any confusion here. <laughs> no one's like zebra, zebra. <laughs> this is all zebra crossing. Um, the horse is weird. <laughs> weird like movement. It's like can you go here or you can go here. Hail to this guy. But I think my favorite is him. I think the minister, right? Uh, oh, what is this? Elephant. 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 Yeah. Rook. Sorry. Yeah. Rook. Rook. The rook. rook. Oh. Elephant. Downtown Abbey, are we? Uh, <laughs> elephant is just like the Hulk. Is like the Hulk smash. <laughs> just goes straight. <laughs> I just don't like people who who like chess, okay? Because it's like the people who like math, okay? They have to <laughs> let everyone. Yeah. They've let everyone know. Like they bring it up in conversation when it's not even organic. They're like, "Hey, oh, you, you guys like chess? Like, dude, we were talking about freaking Game of Thrones. What are you talking about? <laughs> I like chess. Dude, you want to play chess? Like, no, nobody plays chess. <laughs> Shut up. Uh, chess is the green leafy vegetables of the board game. It's good for your brain, but nobody wants to finish it. You know? So um, that's chess. Uh, um, now, okay, I'm, I'm not gonna. Uh, I'm gonna talk about this game in detail later. Okay. <laughs> yes. Because it breaks friendships. <laughs> okay, and I like all of you guys, and I don't want to break friendships. But I think the game I played the most in my life is uh, is. Uh, 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 no, I played this game. I don't know if you guys have played. It's called Bluff. Yes. Yes. Oh, I love Bluff so much. This Bluff <laughs> is a mind game. Okay. Bluff is a poor version of poker. Okay. It's preparing you if you if you don't want to bother learning the rules of poker, which is lame. I don't know why everyone loves poker so much. I love bluff. Okay, in college we used to play bluff so much. I love it, but because I just overdo it. I over overdo my bluff. You guys know what the I'll tell you the rules of bluff. Okay, so someone says, okay, this is uh, two of spades, right? So now everyone's like, put uh, the same color. That's the rule. Okay. So you say yeah. Now it's put face down. So you could be bluffing that you have the card, or you could be telling the truth. That's it. That's the easiest game to explain. Now if you pick it up and it's a bluff, I have to keep everything. If it's an art, they have to keep everything. This simple game goes on for like four months uh, because 
It is so intense. Because everyone has different ways of bluffing, right? My way of bluffing is to be, like, act like I'm bluffing. So it's like, it's like meta. It's like, <laughs> take it! I don't have any cards. Take it! Take it, I could be bluffing. It's just like, it's like reverse psychology. I'm totally bluffing. Just take it. And the moment they take it and I was not bluffing, I just go back to my card. Like, take it, take it. It wasn't a fucking bluff, bro. But the, I think the most consistent psychopaths are the ones who don't have any expression, which yeah. is the classic yeah. poker face, which is... <laughs> Dude, I think it's a bluff. Take. Hello? What? His whole family died? Dude, your whole family died? Okay. Fine, just take the car. Do you like it? You had fun? Thank you so much for watching Chai Time. It was super nice to shoot this one. And thank you for subscribing and sharing and liking and commenting and letting me know. You might think that it doesn't matter, but it, it means a lot to me when you comment saying, Hey man, I like the video. Make me smile. My mom saw it. My dad saw it. Also, I'm coming to America. April, full month I'm touring. I'm going to Chicago, Philadelphia, Washington DC, Dallas, Boston, New York, San Francisco, LA, Whew, a lot of places. I'll see you in America, I'll see you in India, I'll see you everywhere. And if you get bored, you can always see me on your hat and YouTube. Thank you.